when we designed the robot, we said we have a, only a certain number of motors, and the question was, what features do you want to add to the face? Now, originally when we did this, we actually went with eyebrows and lips, mm -hmm. and there's a lot of justification for that. Those yeah, are sure. typically some of the first things that you Be draw expensive. to. But uh, after many years of working with these platforms, we started to find that it's more the eyelids and actually the chin that's more important. So instead of lips and eyebrows, we'd be talking about a chin and eye, uh, eyelids. So you can think of this as important. If, uh, if I'm talking to you, maybe if I'm just using my eyebrows, but I, I ignore my eyelids, I could be doing this all day long, but my eyes are just open like this the whole time, which is really not cool. Um, same thing with the, with the mouth. So I'm talking to you right now, my lips are moving quite a bit, but no one talks like this. This is really weird, right? Oh. So my jaw is moving. And if you think of puppets, you think of uh, like Kermit the Frog. Um, so Kermit has eyelids, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, and Kermit actually has a chin. What they're moving is the chin. Now, if you want to do something like get a smile, some sort of like uh, effect that's like lips, then what you could do is you could open the mouth and then you could cock the head down. And what you'll get is this shape that looks like a smile.